two of the most popular computer AD design software are AutoCAD and SolidWorks. Both are good for different things and they are usually used for different purposes. In this video, we will try to talk about few reasons why they are important and how they are different. AutoCAD is primarily a 2D software catering to architects, home builders, and civil engineers. It is used to convey layout information quickly and makes ample use of layering such as layers for electrical, plumbing, framing, and so on. Originally, it was a drafting tool, not a modeling tool, and to make a parametric model, you have to do a lot of extra work, which is not the case with SOLIDWORKS. If you are trying to communicate complex designs or big things that already have certain known constraints or features or building plans, then AutoCAD is not going to disappoint you. AutoCAD is usually the perfect software for anything related to architectural design, but it can also be used for electrical engineering projects. It's also good to do quick designs, and it is very good for communicating between designers, architects, and companies in general. SOLIDWORKS is actually a different type of computer-aided design software, and doesn't have to be necessarily compared to AutoCAD, but you can compare it in fact with Autodesk Inventor that can make a product that is very similar to what SOLIDWORKS can do and it is a parametric program for the design of solid parts and assemblies. SOLIDWORKS is a parasolid-based solid modeler and utilizes a parametric feature-based approach to create models and assemblies. Parameters actually refer to restrictions in which values determine the shape or geometry of the model. You build a process that creates a tree of sequential dependent operations. You can then go in and edit items, size operations, and so on from any point in the tree and the changes will cascade through the model. There are some parametric things you can do in AutoCAD now, but not as good as we can find using SOLIDWORKS. AutoCAD is good for 3D modeling of different types of pieces, but SOLIDWORKS can help engineers work on serious assemblies with hundreds of pieces. Difficulty or ease of use SOLIDWORKS is actually one of the easiest CAD programs and it is known for being user-friendly. It has very good tutorials that can help you understand anything you need. There are lots of online help you can find in the form of videos and written tutorials. Just spend some time on it and you will start learning it. It might seem a little bit difficult at first if it is the first CAD software you ever used, but you will be able to work on your projects without problems in a few weeks. AutoCAD, on the other hand, is not as easy as SOLIDWORKS, but it is not that difficult either. Some might think it is hard because it is used for complex tasks and complex 2D designs, but if you use it long enough, it will become easier to use over time. Pricing and Licensing The basic SOLIDWORKS price has not changed since it was first released in 1996. One license of SOLIDWORKS standard is $3,995. The annual subscription service for a standalone license, which covers technical support, upgrades, and more for one year, is about $1,295. On the other hand, AutoCAD is a little bit expensive when it comes to pricing because its license is around $1,500 a year, which is almost a couple hundred dollars more expensive than the license of SOLIDWORKS. But there are free versions that AutoCAD provides for students. Also, SOLIDWORKS has some free versions to use. I hope you found this video useful and informative. If you have something to add, please leave it in the comment section below. Also, you can check some of our previous videos. Thank you very much and I'll see you in the next one.